In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the setup of your Epson EcoTank ET4850 printer with a MacBook. So first we will connect this printer with the Wi-Fi network of your home and then we will add in our MacBook. So go to the printer control panel, scroll ahead and look for the setting, select journal settings, network settings, Wi-Fi setup. Wi-Fi recommended, change settings, Wi-Fi setup wizard, select your Wi-Fi network and enter its password and then press OK. Setup is complete, printer is connected to the Wi-Fi, click close, scroll back, go to the home screen. In the MacBook, in the MacBook go to the web browser, type in Epson EcoTank ET4850 driver. Scroll down and look for your printer in the Epson website. Here we can see our operating system, it is detected. It displays the name of the driver and utilities combo package installer. Click download. Open this window and open the file. Double click on the Epson installer, open, that's the download window, accept terms and conditions, you can deselect if you want about the user's information or you can just keep it and click next. So we have already filled the ink, printer is on, so select and click next. On the next screen it will display your printer, select and click next. Click on the install for all the drivers and software. On this window click on the plus button, select Epson EcoTank ET48500 series. Click add, close this window, you can print a test page, printer is successfully connected and it has printed the test page, finish the setup, close this window and click next. Click next, finish and register, you can register your product, close all the windows. So this way we can do the setup of the printer with the Macbook, next step is to do the wireless printing and scanning. For example to do the printing we can just select any document and photo and then we can send a print command. So open any file, photo and then you have to send a print command. Select the number of copies and if you want to make any changes and then click on the print icon. Next step is to do the scanning. So open the lid, place a page you want to scan facing down, close it, go to your printer, click on the scan icon, click scan to computer, ok. On the next screen, click on the laptop option. It will display the list of laptop, MacBook connected. So I'm just going to use this one and then click on the send. Scan is transferred and now we can save it or share it. Now if in case it doesn't work for you, you can simply go to your MacBook and go to the launch pad scroll ahead and look for the Epson Scan Smart app. So it should be somewhere here. That's here. Epson Scan Smart. And it, you can just open and start using it for scanning. So this way we can do the setup of this printer with the MacBook and then we can start using it for wireless printing and scanning. Thanks for watching.